Hello and welcome, my name is Lorna, this is another unboxing and the one I have for you today is the one I thought was going to arrive tomorrow, yesterday even, is A Dangerous Road by Diamond Art Club. So I apologise, the sun is shining straight through the window with us this evening. Uh, let me, should have opened this beforehand. A bit of a try and get in. So I'm hoping this fits on the table, although I don't think it will do. Uh, let's get rid of that out of the way. So let's open this and we have the Diamond Art Club toolkit. And in there, this is a square, so this one does come with some tweezers. I have some baggies, little tray, some pink wax, and got a blue pen, blue squishy, and another multi placer there. So that is all the bits for the toolkit. So those are standard across all the Diamond Art Club kits. The only thing different um, with the rounds you don't get the tweezers, you only get them in the squares because um, the rounds are a lot harder to pick up the squares and you don't tend to use them. Put that aside and There's the picture. Oh. <laughs> so. I have two bags of drills, which should give you an indication on how big this actually is. So the size on the box for this one is 127 centimeters by 52 centimeters. So it's pretty much could be bigger than my table. Um, so. Let's see how I can show that off. I have the sticker with the colour list on, also gives you the size and a picture. Oh, sorry, the uh, sun is uh, just at the wrong angle this evening. There you go, this is called Dangerous Roads. Uh, the artist's name is Fallen Off My. Uh, finger, tongue for the minute but I will put the link for this one down in the description and let's roll this so this one's rolled quite tightly probably because of its size In that that side. Yeah. So this is a square. So the colours. Oh, bear with me. Catch the camera. So just move you there a second. And <laughs> it's not going to fit. So if I roll it from one side to the other, so this is a landscape picture, so this will be the uh, first landscape I've gone done with the uh, Diamond Art Club. We've got two figures in the background there, some pretty trees and mountains. And we've got the main figure on horseback just riding towards us. Pitch keeps going. We've got some more trees. So with the Diamond Art Clubs they print a copy of their key both sides. So we've got one down in this bottom corner and then 
my apologies and the other one is up in the top side there that's that yeah and I think even swinging it round let's try that It's a long one. <laughs> so, although not as wide as my largest picture, this one is definitely longer. And let's have a look at the drills. So, there's pack one. Just going to slide the camera around again. I'll start off with the first pack. Apologies, the sun is right in the wrong position this evening. So, 939. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 packets of the 939. Oh, and a little hitchhiker. The squares, let me just uh, lower you down, see if I can get rid of some of the sun a little bit. The drills look fantastic. So this will be my first square kit from Diamond Art Club. They look beautiful. Couple of hitchhikers there in the seven seven five. Oh, make that a little bit extra of nine three nine. Oh, oh, look at this purple. That's like a proper Roman Empire Imperial purple. Colour doesn't seem to show quite the same on the camera, unfortunately. So looking through the lens and. But, oh, that's a gorgeous colour. 550. If anyone knows that one, it's beautiful. 336. 820. Oh, that's nice burgundy. 154. A few of those. Right, forgive me, my hands aren't working quite great this evening. Oh, some bright colours in this one. So, some eight, two, threes. Got four bags for that one. And our old favourite 310 nice reasonable three bags of that one so we've got 327 nice purple some off whites some nice blues that's really nice you can really see how neat these squares are compared to other squares I've done. Some lovely bright colours to go against the uh, those darker trees in the landscape. So, cover it all. Small packs of peachy colours. I like this picture, it 
lots of uh, love to read adventure books and it just reminds me of like Lord of the Rings and sort of uh, so I used to read like, books by an author called David Eddings and uh, lots of uh, riding away from bad guys in uh, forests so got some lovely colours here not a pink person but there's some pinks there they look good some nice olivey greens yellow and reds so, they all look absolutely beautiful quality oh it's going to be so nice to work with and so uh, generally I prefer squares over squares over rounds but uh, the rounds I've been doing with the Diamond Art Club are absolutely lovely so they've uh, they've definitely helped me uh, enjoy rounds more than I have done previously and uh, I'm looking forward to trying out these squares as well so as I said I will link the just move all these out of the way I will uh, link the e uh, website address for this one um, if it's available it's probably out of stock um, at the moment uh, Everywhere everyone's locked in lockdown. Everyone's been joining, enjoying a good a bit of crafting time to relax and de-stress. So, but this is going to look absolutely gorgeous. Really excited. Well, thank you very much for joining me, and I hope you join me for my next video. And uh, this one, that next one should be a uh, how I kit up my uh, my uh, diamond paintings ready to work on and um, if anyone would like me to do how I de -kit as well I'm more than happy to show those um, but until then thank you